Morning, people. That was quite cheap. That's a that's a mirror, complete unit for a Scania. That was 120 quid, including that, that was. Cheap, isn't it? I've got a starter motor fit today on the Merc and all. Well, first job I've got to do, well, it's not a job, but well, first thing I'm going to do is, I went to Tanvix the other day, see our Pete at Tanvix, and he he got on the phone to a farmer, one of his mates, like, well, one of the people that uses him, and he says, uh, hey, I just talked to this man, I got on the phone to this farmer, and uh, this farm went, oh, mate, I'm sick of hearing your voice. My lad, that's all he listens to, your channel all the time. I'm sick of hearing you. <laughs> anyway, we was having a laugh at that. And I says, uh, he farms uh, around this neck of the woods sometimes. There must be like some contract farmers, I'd have thought. And I says, next time you're down here, give us a ring and I'll surprise him. I'll, uh, I'll come and see him in the field. So Pete's rang me this morning. He says, he's near... Where's my granddad? I bet the battery's come off. Is near a uh, is near Farndon, like chasing the combine. So go and see him. So that's where I'm going now. I'm gonna go and see him. If my van starts. And we've got Lear Dag here, obviously. See, that's it, that's why lock. Look at that. Yeah, I've still got the charging struggle on this beast. Still loses its power, that's why I disconnect the battery all the time. But hey, it's a struggle bus, isn't it? Everything's gonna be a struggle, isn't it? Which is the way now. Well, these fields haven't been combined yet. It should be round here. He sent me to a pin location. Right, I'm going to bring up Pete. That's him, man. Are you, Jack? Hello. Hello, mate. How you doing? <laughs> Say hello to YouTube. I've got everything. I've been sent by your own man. You not play my channel enough, you reckon? You're actually going to listen to me enough on my channel. This is Jack's tractor here, isn't it, Jack? You're doing the grain run, ain't you? Yeah. Running grain about is. Is it all right, Jack? This run, this fence, are they good? Oh, brilliant. They're Rolls Royce. They're the yeah. Rolls Royce tractors. Do you reckon they are, yeah? That, everyone says they are. Hot. Yeah. I bet you've got all the mod cons in there, Jack, ain't you? Yeah, stock specification. Is it? There you can see, free advertisement for your mate there. Oh, look at that, Lord. <laughs> That's good, isn't it? Have you got water in these tyres? No, the other one does. I've only really just yeah. learned about this water in the tyres trick. I never knew about it. For weights, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. It's, it's, Keep the weights. Yes, yeah, it's as easy as that. It's, it's, it's easier than putting weights on, isn't it? Yeah. So you say it's having to put a front weight on the front, which then makes your tracks more longer if you have a front weight on yeah, the front. Yeah, so you may as well just put water in your tyres. Yeah. It's a cheaper option, I should think, isn't it? Because you don't need to buy a weight, do you? Yeah, you just yeah. Fill it up with, you just fill it up with things. It's very up and coming at the minute. It's very up and coming. Nice to meet you, mate. Yeah, thank you so much. No problem, mate. Nice to meet you. You keep viewing my channel, won't you? Annoying your dad with my voice. Keep farming, Jack. Keep farming, lad. It is the farming struggle, mate. Oh, I gave some of my stickers. Well, right, come on, let's go to work, Lear Dag. Now, this lorry with the starter issue, this is the one that I repaired the wire on a bit ago. It was a signal wire down there. It's still on, I can see it. He reckons it's got an intermediate fault where it don't, sometimes it won't start, but a bit of a coincidence, isn't it? Let's have a listen. Oh, yeah, it's right. Oh, then it does start. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Yeah, let's change the starter. It's not engaging, is it? Stays engaged for a bit. Yeah, let's choose starter. I thought it might have been something to do with that wire, but it's not. Right, let's see how much of a job this is going to be. Ah, oh, it should be all right, shouldn't it? No, oh, it's in a perfect little place there, isn't it? Worst job's going to be the wires on top, but that don't look bad. I ought to really do a day in the life of Lear Dag, didn't I? Hey, it'd be an exciting one, though, wouldn't it? Everyone would just be too thrilled by it, because he's that busy all day. Aren't you, Lear? Are you going out for a tiddles today, Lear Dag, or not? It just old, just oh, oh no, doesn't look like his. Oh, he is lot. He's out and about now, people. There we go. The famous stretch. Where's the next one? A bit warm. Yeah, 
about the sun there, Dag? There we go, there, Dag. It's off. Perhaps I ought to have checked that that was the right starter before I took it off. But never mind. You got that starter off just fine there, Lear Dag. You didn't struggle at all there, did you? It's ever so helpful, isn't it, Dag? Right, let's check this ring gear. Ooh, fuck it now. Oh, look at that pocket lock. Seen the ring gear off, hasn't it? Chewed it up a bit, hasn't it? I'll ring him, see what he wants me to do. Yeah, just rang him. Uh, obviously, that starter's not engaging right, is it? So it's it's took chunks out of that ring gear. He says how long will it last. I mean, it could last days, it could last years, couldn't it? But he says just, just chuck the new one on and we'll see how it goes. So I'll do, man. Let's just chuck the new one on. At least the new one's right, anyway. And here we are. After months of planning and years of research, we might have the first glimpse of the rarest of all living animals. If we have done our research correct, we should, just around this corner, stumble across the rarest Leedag in his own habitat. Ah! <laughs> as, as you can see, here he is. We don't want to startle him. It's very hot for the Leerdag. He's just had his water. Oh, he might have seen us. We'll just creep out of here and leave him in his own. We don't want to upset him. They do lots of hibernating, does Leerdags. There, a glimpse of the rare Leerdag. It sounds okay. Well, that one did. I think it'll be alright. Just chuck them cogs of the tannic, but it'll be alright. I think it'll be alright. It's an old gal anyway, isn't it? As, as he says, he says it'll need replacing soon. It's going a bit old, this is. It'll need this on it soon at the front. You know what I mean? It gets to an age, don't they, where you either you have to spend a lot of money on them or get rid of it. So I think he's going to get rid of it soon. Right, what else are we doing? Al's coming down to plug on to one for me. And he's bringing me some parts and all for the other ones. So, yeah, we'll wait. What a wonderful sight to see. So, so, so handsome and so rare. Just spotted this. Look, I always love rooting in scrap. You know what I'm like, guys? Look. Oh, has it got a hole in it? No, it's like new. Banseline for birdie. I don't like them when they're up on these stilts here because the kids fall off and don't they break their arms, break, break everything, don't they? I like to sink them in the ground. I'll have to take that because that's just going for scrap, isn't it? So I'll have to, I'll have to recycle that bad boy. What else we got here? Hotel oh, something good. Mm, bit of shelving, stainless there. Look, I don't want to go in your normal scrap. That's stainless. Look at your barbecue here. Trouble is, I've got loads of barbecues. Can you ever have too many barbecues? I think you can, can't you? No, leave it, Chris, leave it. I'll take the trampoline now. I'm having that. Our owl's here, look, and Alf is here and all. He's bought me some parts now. He's my, my new parts man, Alf, isn't that? <laughs> Hello, Alfie. I'm here to help. You are, well done. You're here to rescue? Yeah. <laughs> Good lad. Oh, that's cool in there, Al. Yeah. Fucking just give me Chris. What are they? Must be this one. Fucking hell, that's hot. Fucking hell. <laughs> Gee, I can't drink. Fucking hell. That's not a pleasure eating them. Fucking hell, that's horrible. I'm sure Chris likes hot food. Fucking don't. <laughs> yeah. Are you just eating them normally? How's your mouth, my mouth burning? Just read that lot. Perfect with beer. Yeah. I've got some beer in the back of the bus if you want. I've got one cider. <laughs> oh, can't get on the beer already. Al's bought me spares, look, and he's given me a Dr. Pepper. I didn't think I liked Dr. Pepper, well, it's not too bad. Uh, I wasn't hungry, but I was real thirsty. Must have drunk myself about 15 Dr. Peppers. What's that off, guys? It's off a film. Right, this is what's wrong with it. The ball boulder was corroded. Oh, that looks a bit corroded. But the ball boulder was corroded to Al on his indicator. So Al's got me this. Look, picked up this from Partick for me. I need to get my aircon done, don't I? 
I need to be like, oh, with a nice air con. If there's anyone around new that wants a bit of free advertisement, as long as they regas my air con for me, uh, come and gas my air con, please. So Lear Dag's not overeating. I'm not bothered about myself overeating. It's more Lear Dag, really, I'm worried about because I don't like him getting too warm. I know he's a chihuahua and he's used to these hot countries, but still. Yeah, so if you're a, if you're a regasser of these thingies, just uh, email me there, look. And uh, around new content, obviously. Freebie. Freebie for me and then free advertisement for you. You'd think that's a new ball baller, wouldn't you? Right, guys, Al's just said, why don't you auction stuff off, Chris? Is it auction? What's it called? Is it auction? No. What, what do you call it? What do you call it? Not auction, is it? What is it? Raffle. raffle that's it. That's it. I've got it right now. Everything's a struggle. Right, he said, why don't you raffle stuff off? That's how people earn a bit of extra money on YouTube and stuff. You know, because I get limited all the time. So I thought, went to Doddington Park at the weekend, and I thought, look, I've got these photos. Well, that's a glass photo of the bus. Dints included, stickers removed. Everything's a struggle bus, isn't it? Oh, look at the dog struggling. It's cool now, you see. It's in there, cool. Yeah, so I'm thinking, I'll sign it, obviously. Professional struggler, or the struggler. Chris Allen, a.k.a. the struggler. Uh, I'll sign it, uh, and then I'll do a raffle on my channel at some point. I don't know when. Whenever I can organise it. I should think I'll have to ask Luke when I see how you do it, because I, I ain't got a clue about anything, have I? So, like, £2 or whatever, a ticket. If all of you buy a ticket for £2, 20,000 tickets, uh, it's like 40 grand, isn't it? <laughs> hey, Al, 40 grand. Yeah. Alf? Yeah. Could we live, could, what, what would you do with 40 grand? Pay for a truck? Yeah. What, a scan you? Yeah. Uh, I still got his roof on, look. Nick, what would you do with 40 grand? You've got 40 grand, don't you, Nick? He don't need 40 grand, people. He's already got 40 grand, don't you? Uh, yeah. So that's what I'm going to do. Even if I sell, like, 10 tickets, better note, isn't it? You know what I mean? We've got them, got key rings, look. But I'll just auction the main one off to see how it rolls. And if it's good... Oh, not auction yet. Why is it raffle? Raffle! Raffle it off. Two pound a ticket, LA. Ten or a ticket? One, one pound. <laughs> no, two pound a ticket, isn't it? One Surely we're going to sell ten tickets. It cost me 20 quid, didn't it? One pound will be better. How much did that cost us? 26 pound. 30 quid. No, it cost 60 quid oh, 60 quid. Fuck it. I'm going to lose money on this now, then, ain't I? <laughs> oh, cost me 60 quid for these people. Two pound a ticket. Come on. If I sell 20,000, that's four, that's for 40 grand. <laughs> Penny. It gets worse here. Yeah. Oh, I'll be out of pocket again, Alfie. He's a good businessman, Alfie, isn't he? Penny. Penny a ticket. Right, so you'll see a link in my description. Uh, it might even be on this video. I might I might get moved on to it that quick. So you'll see a link in, in this description. Underneath there, you press that little tick arrow thing in there and then it'll have a link to it. You click on the link and I don't know what you do from there because I ain't got a clue what I'm doing. So yeah. But Luke will sort it out. Whoa, we're going to be rich. Yeah, we are. <laughs> Ten tickets. <laughs> Ten tickets. <laughs> laughing like a lot. Jesus. I'm going to be out of pocket again, guys. That's got surcharge on it. Oh, 100 quid. So that needs to go back. At this time next year, we'll be millionaires. Leader. He's guarding the raffle stuff. I can, if you're struggling, Al, I can always ring Miss Stewart up, you know, from Arvico. <laughs> if you need a bit of advice, you know, is there on the end of the phone. You know, me, me go-to Iveco specialist. This is an Iveco, guys. You know, it's got to be a struggle in hell. Yeah. We like a good old Iveco struggle. This is why we've had to ring your dad up, health, because, no, you know what I mean? We've got to get the specialist here, haven't we? Right, let's see if Partick got this ad blue cap right, just off a picture. Yeah, let's get zoomed in a little bit. There we go. Oh, really intense now we're going in with it, Alf. Aren't we? Yeah. Hey! Yeah. Well done, Partick! Woo! Save the day again, my Partick Al. Yeah. Remember, raffle in the description. <laughs> <laughs> Prime and water, that blue. Yeah. Purging it. Purging it. Oh, sounds very Purging professional, it. Al. So that's the injector unit then, Al, is yeah, it? That's the injector unit. Ain't it a load of shit, this ad? No, you just take them out, put them in boiling water. Do you want to clean them? What does it clean the jets out like? Or whatever it is. Oh, I'm gonna stopped, Alf. Alf has done something to that. We're going to try it again. No, I'm trying to purge it now. What's purging mean? Same thing. 
It's different, but similar. It's different. It's complicated. Yeah. <laughs> That's all you say, Al. Yeah, you know what you know? It's just compl it's complicated. It's complicated, okay? okay? It's complicated. Yeah. Just baffle people with what science. It? Oh, it sounds different. Sounds a bit more spicier. This one does the purging than the, than the priming. We're priming, we're purging, I think it we're raffling. <laughs> what am I doing now, Al? I'm simply wandering around like a dick here. Right, I've got to do something. Else. I've got to, I've got to yeah. inspect it. Now he's cleaning it now. Three minutes cleaning. It cleans itself even. Press of a button, now it's cleaning. Everything's just buttons now, isn't it? Eh? Just press buttons all the time. Press buttons, clean it, press buttons, clean it, prime it, press the button. Ah, freaking, it's a shit world we're living nowadays, isn't it? Back in the day when you had to clean something, like you'd have to actually remove it and clean it. Nowadays, no, no, no. You don't remove stuff, Chris, nowadays, you just press a button. Right, the problem is here, look, this is come on, right? And it keeps hitting this spring, so every time he puts his body up and puts it down, it crushes this wing in. Because it's too close to this spring here, and it needs a plate or something welding up there. Or, being as my welding is so shocking, I might, like, uh, what do you call it? What do you call them? Self-tapping things. You know what I mean. <laughs> Right, I'll look in his scrap for a bit of plate to go there. Oh, look at that, guy. Look at that, it's even got holes drilled into it. There's a lovely bit of the scrap there, we'll have that, thank you. Perfect. Get a picture of you lot, lot, all fucking not doing out again. I haven't mine today. We start at six, not like you, Kelly. Fuck off. I've earned my money today, I'm charging you double time. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, there's only one six o'clock in the day, and that's not in the morning. Look at that now, look. Beautiful, that. So what do you reckon this then, Al? Pump then, you reckon? Yeah, I think the pump's knackered. Al thinks the pump's knackered because he's tried prime it up, but it won't prime up to enough pressure. Fucking Jesus. No, it's fucking simple, is it? Locked out the cunt in lorry now. Says he can't turn the key. He's fucking gone and put his windows up, shut the door. I've just shut... Well... The door was off, like clicked over. I went to shut it. Fucking lock the keys in it. You know where the spare keys are, don't you? You know where everyone keeps the spare keys, don't you? Yeah, on the same key ring as the fucking ignition keys. Hey, this is handy, isn't it? It's just shut the windows in the fucking thing. And it couldn't <laughs> get the ignition. Yeah, but I don't know. And he's good, isn't he? Teaching everyone how to break into lorries. Yeah, I'm good at that. Up there. Yeah, that's where I did. See that wiggling. Al's got the wiggle on. Yeah. Go on, I'll wiggle it. Wiggle it. Just do it. Got a metal ball. We'll be able to get straight in there. So I can bend it to the fucking angle we want. Yeah, we need a. Where you found that anyway? It's my uh, rods to do wiring. Mm. You run wires for it. Oh, oh, oh. you're closer now. He was nearly touching cloth then. We need something that's like metal wire, like rigider. I think you can just cut a bit of that off, though. Because we're struggling here. Well, not too flexible. Al oh, might have found the perfect. Ooh. Could have got my Gary Grinder then, haven't it? Al's new and improved gone fishing rod. Yes. Out with the old and in with. Why are you wobbling it? Fucking cunt, are they? What the hell are you lot doing? What are you doing? They're trying to pull the window down. They've seen it on YouTube, haven't they? What? They it against the motor. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, they've got their other plan. Let's see who breaks in quicker, boys. Open the door, then. You two or us two? See who's the better breaker in arrest. Yeah. <laughs> you can't do it again. Looks yet. rocky. Oh. Seems like... Oh. Seems oh. like Chrissy. It looks yeah, like the professionals. Looks... Yeah. Yeah. Not me, she's had that one. <laughs> Aye. And now, what these lads are going to do now is take all that gaffer tape off. <laughs> right, the original problem with this was Alfie said, not that Alfie, the other Alfie, yeah. said that he couldn't get the ignition on. Does it want a bit of a bit of lube on it now? Feels like the barrel's about yeah. to pull. Okay. Has it got a flat battery on this at all? No. Oh no, you're alright. Mm. Yeah, you want a bit of lube, but you got a bit of W here somewhere.
It was his fault, everyone. <laughs> Isn't it, Joe? It was his fault. Yeah. Alfie? Yeah. It was Alfie's fault, wasn't it? Alfie. Big Alfie. Alfie. Not little Alfie's fault. Don't blame little Alfie, blame big Alfie. There you are, look. Bit of grease. Look, what goes in and out there. Lovely now. Works first time, every other time. See you later, boys. See you back. Right, I'll get on with the inspections and then uh, go into Scotters, I think, to fit that scan your arm. Oh, for God's sake, look, I just literally got onto the A1 lot slip road and we're already snarled up. Oh, yeah, he's awake now, look at that. Hi. <laughs> what the hell is that? What kind of chicken is that? Like a dinosaur chicken or something? What the fuck? What the hell is Just a whole chicken? Shabba, fancy doing that. Shabba, if you didn't have bad luck, you'd have no luck. Now, I hope I don't have to get into his cab because I ain't got his keys. That means going all the way to Scott's main yard, get his keys, come back here. Oh, don't tell me this. Oh, frickin' hell. It's the wrong frickin' one. Oh, you're joking me. No, fuck. Oh, even the glass looks different. Oh, my God. I can't even swap the glass around. Politics Walsh up and out about half six now. Quarter seven. Oh. Yeah, I've just rang Andy up and he laughed down the phone at me. <laughs> Cheers, Andy. <laughs> he said, no, mate, but go back up tomorrow. I said, yeah, I'll have to come back up tomorrow, won't I? It's as if in doubt, mate. Just blame Shabba. That's right. Shabba, your fault again. Wrong one. Your fault, Shabba. Right, guys. Catch you on the next one. I'm home now. See you later. Woo! -woo! Yeah, you will. Yeah, you will. I know, doggies. I'm coming. I'm coming.